Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Microsoft Office Learning. In this video, I'm going to discuss with you if or function in Microsoft Excel. If or function is an important function and uh, let's get into the video without wasting any further time. So here I created a very basic example of the student results on the left side, the name of the students and quarter one marks, quarter two, three, four marks and the total marks column here. And here there's a column for the behavior as well. And here is the column for the university place. Now the school need to determine or college need to determine how many students will secure their place in the university. So now we need to test some criteria to do this. So we will use the if or function. So start the formula. Start with is equal to if. Press tab and then or press tab now i need to enter the logical test one what is the first criteria i mentioned the criteria here the total marks is a 200 should be a greater than 200 second criteria is behavior should be excellent so the total marks column this one should be greater than this cell which is criteria cell press f4 and then comma enter the second logical test which is about the behavior this column should be equal to this column press f4 to fix this and then close of bracket i have entered the two criteria you can enter the as many criteria as you want so press comma and now value if true true in this function, if any of the criteria meet, the formula will give you the true value. It will give you the result. So if any of the criteria meet, what I want in the result column. So I want the word Y in the result column. And what if, if, what if any of the criteria doesn't meet, then I want the word no in my result column. So close up bracket press enter so it's saying y and then double click at the bottom to copy the formula it's saying y why it's saying y because the total marks are greater than 200 and behavior is excellent here the both criteria is meeting however if i see the student sam although its marks are below 200 but its behavior is excellent that's why the result column is showing y because one of the criteria meet so in this formula if any of the criteria meet the formula will give you the result it doesn't have to meet all the criteria so it's just uh, if any of the criteria meet then it will give you the positive result give you the true value start with equal to if or logical test one two three how many you want then the result what if the value comes true and what if the value comes false so this is a very basic function. Uh, I hope you understand how to use this function in Microsoft Excel. Please comment below if this video is helpful.